96, my uncle had gave me a call. And, uh, yeah, you know, he talked to me. And he was like, uh, he said, uh, if some people want to talk to you, like, want to talk to me, then automatically, you know, I think it's, uh, they want to talk about Friday Night Lights. They done, yeah. You know, they done read the book, you know, blah, yep. blah, blah. And uh, I said, well, what, what, what are they, I, now, that, what they, is they down here? Like, is they in Dallas or? What is it? What is it? He's like, nah, boy, they, they want you to come play football in Virginia. I was like, come play football? I was like, come on, man. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, for real. He said they want you to come. They got a semi-pro team in Cold Pepper, Virginia. And the, the, one of the owners that contacted me, he wants, to, he wants to talk to you. So he gave me the number. And uh, I didn't call him for a week. I didn't call him, you know, and then. My uncle called me one day and said, boy, you, why you ain't calling this man? You know, I'm going to call him, I'm gonna call him today. And I, I ended up talking to him for a little while, and I got off the phone, and I called him. And so enough, man, he, his uh, guy named was Caesar. He was uh, part owner of the team. Uh, Cold Pepper Minute Man, man. <laughs> yeah, man, he, 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 came, he sold it to me, man. He, he sold it to me. I was like, you know what, man, okay. And I, and, I, and I did it mostly because I could hear it in my uncle's voice. You know what I'm saying? I could hear it in his voice. So I did it. And, and, and a lot of and a, and a, the main part of me did it is because I let it down by by by, by dropping out of college, by by fucking out of college. I'm that's how you felt. So, that's how I felt. So I did it. You know, I went ahead and I told my best friend, I told P man, I said, man. I'm from, I'm from shoot to Virginia. So I went to Virginia, man, and uh, uh, got down there. It was, it was good, bro. I mean, I actually, I actually got that vibe back. I actually got that vibe back, and uh, boom, here we go. You know what I'm saying? They're playing, and I'm, I'm playing with cats like from different states. And, you know, Virginia and uh, D.C. and Maryland, that's all right there, you know. That's new to me, you know what I'm saying? And, uh, man, I'm like, wow, this is like, this is like what I should this is like college. You feel what I'm saying? This is what I, this is what I, this is where I should have been, you know what I'm saying? And at this level, you know, around this type, like this type of uh, atmosphere. Yeah. And, uh, man. Golly, bro, we, you know, we, uh, uh, one of the owners was, used to be a field goal kicker for the Redskins, and he owned, uh, a, a few, uh, uh, dealerships, car dealerships, and, uh, and me and this guy, this guy, we call him Bull, <laughs> and, uh, he played middle linebacker when I tell you this dude, he had, his name, is, they gave him the right nickname, and he was 6'4", and, now, I'm used to seeing, like, I just, I play that Rangers, so I'm, I'm not, we had one kid, one kid on our team, bro, that was a, that looked like he should have been pro at, at, at Rangers. But now I'm around <laughs> about 15 to 20 of them that look like that. <laughs> God dang, like, <laughs> boy, you a monster, you know what I'm saying? It, right, right. It, it, it was, it was cool, man, and uh, me and Bull, we worked at the dealership, and, uh, you know, they got me an apartment, and it was, it was, it was like, it was, this is what I, this is where I should have, you know, it just felt like right, you know, and, and, and everybody was, you know, a lot of people was excited to, you know, this, who we got, this dude comes from Texas, and uh, so enough, man, so, of course, with me being out of state, and, and we known for the football, I'm not, I'm taking, I'm not trying to let, I'm not trying to let Texas down. You know, I'm going to go up here and I'm going to show my raw butt naked. I'm going to give them what I got, you know. And yeah. Just, bro, man, it, 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 I did it, bro. I mean, we we went to the playoffs. We didn't get the we, – we made it to the second round, you know. You know, and then, like I said, man, I had a blast, man. And, and yeah, we're going we gonna to get it next year. You know, we're going to get it next year. And then, boom, right around uh, – 
right around when the season was for to kick in, you know, like a few months, <clears throat> Caesar took me to the hospital, to the, to the doctor that, they, that that the team had. He took me to the doctor in, in Richmond. And, uh, no, I take that back in Charlottesville, uh-huh. Charlottesville, Virginia. And, uh, we went and, uh, we did a, I was going to get the fluid drain out of my knee. But then they wanted to do the MRI. So they did that. And, uh, called us back uh, a couple of days later. And, uh, we went back down there. And he told me, he told me and uh, Caesar, he said, hey, look, uh, I don't know how he's doing it. But that, that man got the knee of an 80 year old man. Oh my God. That's what he told me. He said, if you take a, a wrong hit, a good hit on that knee, you won't be you won't be walking. You say you'll be walking, you'll be in a wheelchair. You won't even be on a cane no more. And that that was like that's like sticking his hand in my chest and ripping out my heart. Yeah, man, and boom. Dad, you tell me this. And uh, he was like, seriously, he said, man, if you take the wrong hit, the right hit on that leg, that's it for you. Man. And man, I had had sat there like it was a dream, bro. Like, it was like, am I dreaming? Is this real? Like, it's like everything else faded away, bro, and I'm just sitting there. And then on the way home, I just was like, bro, is this, is, is this real? Like, and all the coaches, you know, they, they, we sat down and, and we had dinner and we talked and, you know, and I told them, like, man, I'm not going to, you know, I appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? And they was even like, nah, man, we not going to even let you do it. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Which I appreciated that. You know, they, they told me that they at least cared a bit or something. So they, I mean, he's not going to let you do, do, do yourself like that. So, you know, I, I, I called my uncle, told my uncle what was up. And at that time, my uncle told me I, he said, told me I got, he said, boy, you got a son down here. <laughs> 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 my first kid was, 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 was born. Like, I was like, what? He was like, yeah, the, the girl came over here with the boy, with the baby. Boy, he looked just like you too. I was like, oh, man, so, <laughs> I was excited about that going home, you know what I'm saying? Right, right. But, you know, I don't know, man, I, you know, I was sad. Now I'm going back to Odessa, back to, you know what I'm saying, what I'm saying, where it all started. I said that, that the Rams 96, 97, they won a state championship. Yep. You know what I'm saying? So now I'm back at that. Man, it's just, it, from that, from that point right there, it, it just went, it just went, my, my, it just got bad. And then, <clears throat> and then when he died, man, in 98, bro, I lost my mind. Man. He passed away. I mean, literally lost my mind, bro. I, 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 it was, I get this, you know, took it from me, football. I actually get it back, get the groove back, get the, get the mojo back. And then it gets ripped away from me again. And then I go home, you know, I'm, I'm there for a year or so. And, uh, my, my you know, and I, you know, that's where I met my ex-wife. And, uh, my uncle died in 98. I got married in, in 98 too. My uncle was a preacher. He married us. Yeah, he married us, bro. He, he, he married us, bro. And he, he died, bro. Like, he died like maybe four, three or four months after that. So he died like he died. He died just about the same year, the same uh, month. My dad. He died in September of '98. My dad died in August of, of 2000. And then yeah. that, that crazy thing about my dad dying. That's and, and when my uncle passed. You know, like I said, I was I was out of there, bro. Like. I was numb to the world, literally. 
like I was, I was, I, uh, and, and I'm, I'm not just going to be honest. I was like Tony Montana. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Scarface. I, mean, yeah. I was out of my mind, bro. Like, right. literally. Like, I stay numb, bro. And I'm not bragging about that. It's just, I tried to fill that void, bro. I couldn't, yeah. I didn't even want to go outside. Just felt that bad. Yeah. I, that, that, I lost the, the, the one person that loved me, that loved me, bro. I know they love me without a doubt, you know. And I was sick, bro. I was sick. I just, man, I was disappointed. That was a very that that started a snowball effect right there.